Is Jeff going to get punched in the side of the head at the beginning of this podcast? No, we are not. Well, my lady was all excited. She finally got, she took her, what was it, hon? My board. She took her boards, and she just passed. And Ooh. she goes, I'm officially a nurse. And I said, I've never gotten a blowjob from a nurse before. <laughs> <laughs> and her response is, well, you didn't get one from not a nurse before <laughs> that. <laughs> I still haven't gotten a blowjob from a nurse yet. One day, I'm telling you, boys. <laughs> she's just going to wake up. She's going to keep laying on her forehead every morning. Come on, just one time. Nurse, come nurse, look at this. Help. I thought you were a head nurse. <laughs> come look at this. Oh. I got a situation. Congratulations. Right Congratulations, honey. I'm so proud. I love you. So proud. Blow jobs. Blow jobs. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. Welcome back to the Gentleman's Den. Jeff, Frankie, Sean, Kayla might be popping around every now and then. We are back. We took, our, we took a week hiatus because we were at C2E2. Week hangover. Real quick, that previous story reminded me the other time you texted me. You said, do you want to get dinner? And I said, you spelled blowjob wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck that was a good one wow you know it I, was good it was good. clever clever girl clever girl I, I, I feel really really energized right now because we're not doing the podcast at 11.30 at night fucking the wider <laughs> yeah. a little wider fucking wider a little wired today a little sober than usual too yeah well uh, well, we can get I got my buzz <laughs> back let's get rid of these real quick I'm, oh god gosh man. I can't reach I just pretend. Oh, grazie. Um, oh, grazie. And everyone, make sure you stay hydrated. <laughs> My chair's on its last leg. Boys. Last leg. <laughs> well, hey, day. you know we we can we can always uh, we can always do what we say in the car, but it ain't gonna happen. Lower the well, bar, get fucking good cheese. Yeah, <laughs> you know. Every time I fart and it vibrates, it's like <laughs> uh, nuts is that and the bolts end? Just loosening. Is that the end? Oh, you're fucking farts, man! I swear <laughs> to God. How much, Frankie? How much what? Does Money would I have to pay you to sniff this seat? <laughs> you don't have enough. <laughs> Promise you that. <sighs> Just deep breath in. <laughs> Dude, it's, it was disgusting. I yeah. fucking catch you too when you would drop ass. I couldn't get away from you. You tried to walk rough, in front of me. Dude. Well, you guys are taking too long looking Fuck at the you. pictures. You do I it on you better move for someone's going to look at you and say, This guy farted. Mama! <laughs> this guy's fucking asshole stinks! <laughs> Well, you guys like stop to look at something. I'm like, nope, keep moving, keep moving. <laughs> keep <laughs> moving. I'm like, wait, what? The the one thing I could say about C2E2 that surprised me more than anything was <clears throat> it didn't smell as bad as I thought it was going to. Really? If you were in front of Jeff. It didn't. Well, no, I'm not. Ta- I'm not. <laughs> yeah, I'm not talking about just ass. I'm just talking about <laughs> oh, those plenty of ass. Because there there was a lot of neck beards and a lot of fat dudes, and I only walked through one wall of armpit. Yeah. Right? There was no other armpit. It was surprising. Just the one. Yeah, just <laughs> just, the one. just the one. It was rough too, man. It was like when you walk and you hit it, and you can actually physically hit the wall. Oh, just oh, trust oh. me. Yeah. Knees buckle. Yeah, yeah. Oh. It's like, yeah. Vomit on my sweater already, mom. Spaghetti. Oh my god. Keep your composure, baby. Dear legs. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Looking like ET. <laughs> But we got it. We saw some ET, ET fucking God, the toys there and all the displays, the fucking gremlin display. Well, yeah, you're, you relive oh. your childhood. First time there, I think we got there just in time. Perfect time. No, I think the whole. I think it was a perfect, perfect time day. day. Everything. All was day, perfect. every day. Yeah. Especially Couldn't when we started drinking at you know 11 a.m. Like right away. <laughs> <laughs> know, we made it in at probably 50 feet and said, we, "Where's we, the yard?" Yeah, <laughs> we literally found BJ. And we're like, all right, let's go get beers. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty much how it works. I wanted to get beers right away, but you guys were smart. I, you're like, yeah. I need a hot pretzel. I'm like, hold on. Yeah. It's yeah. Not, it's like <laughs> build 9 a.m. <laughs> but I didn't know it was going to go that fast. Like, when we were driving down there, and it was like, parking A's filled up. Go to parking lot B. Parking lot B's filled up. Go to parking lots. I'm like, right. fuck, this yep. is going to be rough. We went to A and parked. Yeah, yeah and it was quick. We got in. We went through security. I thought it was smooth and setting up the badges and all that yeah, shit. It was, it was like 
It got how us many to the people beer were tent there? Yard. It went Where? fucking sm- like we got in there by the time we. So but if you security. look back after we got in, it was it crazy. Like it was the like, worst yeah, dude, thing. That's what I'm saying. It was perfect, perfect timing. timing. We perfect. We'll never be able to do that again. No, Our timing was the bad. timing was impeccable. Impe- impeccable. <laughs> you were you, you were actually impregnable. Just stop. Yeah, right it, yeah. It, our timing was impregnable. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Which means we couldn't get it. We it's couldn't get it. <laughs> yes, we just can't get off the wall. Yeah. I was going with Mike Tyson. <laughs> you never know. You like shot out and hit the fucking latex. What is this? And just rolled down. <laughs> Dude, it, it was rolled <laughs> down to the ball. <laughs> <Just, laughs> <Hey>. Jesus. <laughs> oh. it, it was it was worth it. It was it was a fun trip. It was it was perfect. I had a blast that day. I got to meet CM Punk and that. That was, that was I. Cool. I was like so happy for you, <laughs> uh, dude. I mean, good for when you. When we walked past and we seen good that booth, you. and I seen CM Punk, and then I just looked at you, and you were like, "And seriously, that was perfect timing too, because the line wasn't that long. Other times I've seen it, it was long as fuck. Yeah, it you was know, like, like you know, when the, the ice cream truck pulls up, and you're like staring the at the line. side yeah. to look at what flavors." And you just have a smile on your face. You're like, oh, fuck, am I getting the Ninja Turtle gumball-eyed one again? <laughs> That's what Sean reminded me of. Just and then like, as soon as he got it, turned around, there's six kids behind him that were waiting to get a fucking googly <laughs> eye. I felt like the whole day made us feel... I, I felt like a, like a kid again. It was fun. Oh, it, yeah. That, doing that, getting that out of the way as early as we did the was CM Punk? the best. So how did fucking, you feel, Sean? It was cool. Was I, it full... I, 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 I fill the relax. cups. I'm, 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 I'm gonna be honest with you. I, I, I talked. I talked to Zach about this yesterday when we were in the car. I said, "I know why he didn't make it as a UFC fighter. Really small hands. Yeah, yeah. Like if you look at UFC fighters' fists, they're usually they pretty, toasters. pretty wide. Yeah, he had." Not as wide a fist as you want to be a fighter. See, then like, that's when you just got to get close and use those elbows. He just seems too nice too. Yeah, he, he's, he's, <laughs> yeah. He's, uh, he's just part of the fighter. Gene, I don't think yeah. he. Yeah, he doesn't I don't have know. I don't know what his most, background yeah. story you know is. What it but is? everyone most of the time, has those guys are killers, dude. A point in their life where you're either gonna be on the attack or on the defense. And I feel like at some point in your life is where it's more of a life preservation than like a full primal you know what i'm saying like when you're young you're high you got all this testosterone right. you're, you're hyped up you're like let's fucking go and rip his fucking head up but a kid who lives in a gated community with two parents that have a nice marriage yeah a, 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 to some kid who lives in the slums who right. mom's working five it's jobs be different than that UFC, kid that kid in the, in the slums is is gonna die before he gets his ass kicked right it, it can either go one of two ways though it could be he could be ultra violent Everyone's got ultra ready bill. fucking Fight, fight, or it can I'm be not saying, flight, yeah, it could it be, be reversed, flight, or it but, could be flight, and he's fucking just, and then the kid from the fucking good home is just a fucking nutcase. Yeah, but I feel like all of us because that one just time, happens. And all he's go. got those good drugs, so he's probably yeah. all hopped oh, up yeah. on pills, <laughs> just <laughs> chewing on that Adderall like it's yeah, fucking like, pads. Oh, motherfucker, yeah. come on, come on. When we were younger, we would, you know what I'm saying? I remember you fucking getting in a fight and knocking someone out, and it was just like it was it nothing. But now, well, that was a different one. As we're older, you think about it differently. You're like, it's yeah, because really I don't want to pay it. disorderly conduct tickets and right. Yeah, now I. I look back. I am so against like f- I will avoid. It. I don't care if someone calls me a fucking right. pussy. You're a, unless I'm like I'm unless it's a, unless it's an old man at a dirt bar. In the no, he, well, he just jumped on me. <laughs> well, that's the thing. It, it, I it will walk away. That. I will go. There's other bars. Right. I don't care. It, it's not that. It's not back in the day though. Someone called you a bitch. You're like what? Younger it was me the would end have of been. The world. That's what I'm saying. At this and point, like, you could call me whatever the fuck you want. Right. I don't. All right. Sweet. Awesome. Good for you, bud. You feel better. Do you feel better about yourself now? Nah, obviously, if they go ahead and get in your personal space, then it is that survival, and I don't give a fuck. I'll jerk your dick off. I don't fight fair. You and jerking. You're I'm just saying I don't off. fight Frankie, fair. I'm, I'm, a, I'm gonna be honest it's with you. In Frankie. easy way. Are you coming out to us? Are, are you swinging for the I other mean, team? You I'm keep saying, saying you want to jerk dick. So and, and touch it every time. You want to touch, touch it? it? Want to touch it? No, man. No. Sure? <laughs> get the you fuck sure? out of here. I'm right. waiting for you to I'm start going saying. tucked in or out. Out, man. Is my shirt? Is my t- my pants tucked into my shirt right now? Oh, this is a good conversation. Stone zone. We you want to enter there? it? Let's just this get it out the way. Okay, Frankie. Stone are my pants zone, tucked zone. into my shirt right now? It's like opposite. <laughs> if my shirt was tucked into my pants, 
But I don't have my shirt tucked in, so my pants are tucked into my shirt. Just saying. That's a thing. Well, are you what do you socks mean? tucked into your shoes? <laughs> <laughs> Is your underwear tucked into your pants? Right. What's uh, tucked? Uh, you tell me. That's what I'm saying. In or out, bro. So if you got like high <laughs> out. Bo- <laughs> what if you got high boots right. and jeans on? Yeah. Are, you, are your boots tucked into your you jeans? You look like an asshole. Is what you yeah, look your like. boots are tucked yeah. into your jeans. Or do you put your jeans tucked your into jeans your boots? Your jeans are tucked into your boots. And you got your boots halfway up your... I'm pretty sure your pants go over your boots and your boots are tucked into your jeans. That's what I'm saying. Tell me, what what do you do with your Peter Pan boots? No, your pants are tucked into your boots. My pants are tucked into my boots. But your pants are... They're, you didn't really tuck them. See? They're already there. They're already you there. Hold your you hold your boots over, over your pants. Over. This well, that's is the same with my the pants. The most asinine conversation, conversation we've exactly. had on this fucking podcast. <laughs> Stone zone. When you make toast. Come here over here, huh? <laughs> Do you want to get into this? Toast? I wasn't going to bring this up, but... No, when you make toast, what do you expect when somebody makes you toast? Okay, babe, get close to the microphone. Just, I, I, when, I, when I get toast... I say, if someone says, I am sick, can you make me some toast? What do you bring them? Toast. No, stop. Don't say anymore. What do you do? You grab bread, put it in the toaster, throw a little butter on it, bring it <laughs> up. Thank you! <laughs> <laughs> you threw the butter on no. it. No! You didn't butter it? You just gave her dry okay. ass bread? No. <laughs> if it's... She asked for toast, not toast with butter. Oh, right. <laughs> wow. Toast with, with jelly or jam? I was confused. I said, she said, can you make me toast? I said, sure. Oh, I you, said, were do you, you throwing toasted? up? Now, let me ask yes, this question. Yes, she was sick. Were you throwing up? I was sick, but who can No, talk? stop, who stop. Were you, but, you, but were you throwing up? Yeah. Then yes, I would bring you dry toast. Why? Because the dairy is going to curdle in your stomach and make you puke more. No. So I asked her, do you want your toast plain? Yes. With butter. (laughs) Well, what is it? It can't be (laughs) plain with with butter. (laughs) Can can I get a cheeseburger plain with ketchup? I guess you're kind of right because if I go to a restaurant and order toast, normally it's butter. It's already butter toasted. (laughs) Can I get French toast? You just <laughs> French bread toasted. <laughs> I'm so confused though. Like, is it, toast? If someone asks me for toast, it's gonna be toast. I Unless you. you ask for butter, you see. Toast. I, right. I'm putting the butter on there and just real quick though. When and I if, make and you, if they get pissed about it, then I'm eating it. Then I'm eating toast. <laughs> and I was making more toast. Like you said it's, it's plain right. though. Like, so if I went and made it in the toaster, am I putting the butter on first? What if someone says, no. can you get, can you get, can, right. you, can you cut me up an apple? And then you bring it to them. They're like, where's the peanut butter? See, that, that's, different, that's different though. That's different though. Cause right, so, how is it different so, from right, real toast? Quick, this is something for me then. Strawberries. If I said, can you get me some strawberries, please? Or, and you brought me some strawberries. I'd be like, where the fuck's that sugar? Because I'm not eating strawberries without it. Right, so but that's how I've always eaten strawberries. See what I'm saying? But how many people would eat strawberries? Yeah, but I just grab them out of the container, see? bite them off, throw see? the tops out. Yeah, but I think it's like just known all around the world that when you make toast, you put butter on it. It's not known across the world. It's just yeah. some, your head. When some, I make my eggs in the morning, some people like dry toast, yeah. I like dry toast to put on the platter, and then I break my eggs over easy on them, and it oozes. Right. No, it's only when I fry them. I'm so confused. It. If someone asks Stone for toast, zone. I feel like we got to get out of the stone it zone. It would have taken no, two good. seconds to say, can you make me uh, toast with butter? Right. But no, she just said toast. toast so plain. I'm like, she <laughs> toast, toast plain toast. with so butter. Did he go down and butter your toast for you? <laughs> no, I buttered it right away. <laughs> I buttered her biscuit. When I told him, no, hey. plain, I want butter on it. Yeah, this is my yeah. buddy uh, Jeff here. He's a stud muffin. Uh, like if you butter him up. <laughs> <laughs> Not in? Didn't think so. You ever heard of butter jam? Call them beaches. That's a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. One day Jeff's gonna get this blowjob. Way down. But he's get one day he's gonna get a blowjob and it's gonna be and then he's gonna be disappointed for the rest of his life. Oh my stomach hurts. I think I ate too much Taco Bell. <laughs> oh that's that's the girl's version of a yeah, blowjob. <laughs> exactly what's gonna happen what happens such a terrible blowjob you'll never oh to do there's it. no such thing she just grabs it just, <laughs> just blows on bring those lip coolers over here <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, i love you ever seen her eat soup uh, <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing why, why are you why are you just blowing on my dick <laughs> i can stand in front of a fan and get the same fucking <laughs> 
sounds I dangerous. Need, you need to do something I can't do. <laughs> just put my mouth around it. Okay? I can blow on it from here. <laughs> Jeff, oh, Jeff, Jeff just grabs oh. a straw and he's just... Yeah. He's got strong lungs. <laughs> Then you can you could channel the stream better. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you get right at the pee hole. Then you just blow it right on the tippy, right on the tippy oh, top. Oh fuck! You just hammer it right down the pee hole. Oh fucking straw jobs. <laughs> Goddamn stuff. So. We might have this might be the title of the podcast. Straw like jobs. Our C two E two wrap up. Straw oh, jobs. Straw jobs. Yeah, but then you get one of those real earthy girls. Th- that won't use the plastic. Oh, so you got, got a paper straw? No, she's got that fancy, no, <laughs> she's got that the fancy metal. metal straw. And you're like, oh, she's got the good shit. <laughs> <laughs> this bitch I knows what's up. I want to set their game up. Use like the uh, paper towel roll. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> hey, no. oh, that's a lot of air. That's a toe <laughs> curl. I a real, bl- that's a toe real curl. good blow <laughs> job. You'd see the white and the knuckles of your toes. <laughs> <laughs> Your toes be curling so fucking bad. <laughs> oh my god, my face just went numb. What happened? Jesus Christ. Alright, so C2E2 is awesome. Walking around C2E2. I had the same cool. feeling as C2E2. So CM Punk, how was that? <laughs> it was cool. It was it was Was it as cool as you thought it would be? Was he as cool? It, it was it was pretty much exactly what I thought it was gonna be. He's so just deadpan. Just like, oh yeah, hey, mm, yeah, <laughs> All, right. All right, cool. I'll talk oh, to you god. later. That's pretty much what it was. I just wanted my picture. I didn't want an autograph. I don't need a fucking autograph. Shit, I don't need to validate. Nice. I don't need you to validate. Yeah. Sign my, my ass. Well, no, I wasn't. I and plus, I wasn't going to. Plus, I wasn't going to drop another forty. Oh yeah. Well, yeah, what's hard? Shows, what's right. hard nowadays? I had this experience, and it and it frustrated the fuck out of me. I, uh, you know, celebrities and stuff probably get mad because people always want a picture. Yeah. But that's your validation that you Made met it. somebody. Yeah. Well, and, and honestly, if you were like, dude, I met fucking CM Punk someone would be like bullshit right this no, still yeah, pisses me off to this day Ronnie Coleman eight time yeah. Mr. Olympia I met him at an airport and I asked him to get a picture I got a picture but it was on my buddy's camera uh huh the guy used to work with the biggest Ronnie Coleman fan ever yeah and I told him I met him to this day, he still don't believe me because I can't get that fucking picture. That's hilarious. I remember that time you told me you met Ronnie Coleman? I'm like, I did, motherfucker! <laughs> I swear to God! But I swear! I can vouch because I've seen the picture and his <laughs> biceps were as big as your head. Well, well he went in the bath. My buddy went in the bathroom. He comes out. He's like, you got to see this guy. He's fucking huge. I'm like, his cock? <laughs> <laughs> he's like, no, this is the biggest motherfucker I've ever seen in my life. Uh, Here I'm comes Ronnie. I'm like, that's Ronnie Coleman. And the only reason I knew who he was cause is because of this guy that I yeah. worked with. Yeah. Well, that's like when he we... still don't believe me. I met him. When we went to the uh, weigh-ins for that strike force fight all those years ago. There's a reason why I brought the fucking camera. Yeah, no one pictures would, to prove it. No one would have believed that we met Big Black and we met fucking Dan Henderson and Boss Rudin, who Boss has the Rudin. world's longest fucking fingers. This dude oh, yeah. can stick a finger Call in your Dennis. booty hole and have it hang <laughs> on your mouth. That's how long this motherfucker's <laughs> fingers are. Oh, yeah. He has E.T. fingers for the full. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but then we... We also bumped into my favorite wrestler of all time, Tommy Dreamer, walking past us. And the black lady he was yeah. with was like, oh, I like your jacket. I'm like, thanks. Because I was wearing the horror movie Why weapons. you hunt him down? Your favorite of all time and you didn't I've chase met him, him down? I've met him four times already. So oh. it was like one of those ones where I just wanted to be like, sup, dude. I thought you were about to pull a straw out of your pocket. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 real quick, real quick. <laughs> Let me give you a blowjob. I want to talk about what, I don't know what Frankie, what got into you this weekend? What do you mean? I have never. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. The little Bellas. I have never in my life heard you say keep the vision. <laughs> but every person you saw. <laughs> do you yeah. remember this? Everyone, we went up to all the artists. And oh my God. Because they had a different like, vision. Like, bro, keep the vision. <laughs> You bet. I, I was like, there was so what many. The fuck? I said, there was like, can we go to the next booth? Keep the vision. There were so many awkward looks from those guys too. There's. He's like, keep the. Vision. Like, like when you whistle in front of your dog and the he. Fuck is this guy? Talking? Keep the vision. There was some really cool. What do you shit, mean though? Because like, I was I just never funny because I've never. Master I've known you your entire life. Keep the vision, bro. I've never heard you say keep the vision. <laughs> not once, not never. 
<laughs> all of a sudden, so not up. all of one magical day, down at fucking McCormick Place. I just thought that, you know what, they had that vision. I thought maybe there that. was like a sign when we walked in, like keep the vision, <laughs> and it just it burned, burned into your brain. So everyone you talked to. Maybe I did see it at a table. Maybe. I Even the know. beer guy, you went and got a beer, you're like, keep the vision. <laughs> what? <laughs> Bro, I like the way you pour. Keep the vision, bro. <laughs> that, that, that's a thing. <laughs> no, it was just fun. it was just something I observed. I, I you consciously I, didn't, I consciously did not realize it, but now that you do say it, I do think I'm like, yeah, I probably said I, it's about ten different artists. I said respect a lot to the costumers. Oh, you were respecting respect, respect. dude. Respect. <laughs> that was it. Was a it, there was some really cool cosplay though. I mean, oh, dude. Tron. That might be the podcast name. Respect the vision. <laughs> <laughs> Tron Swanson. <laughs> yeah, there's some. What was your favorite costume? Most the, memorable. Besides the ass and titties hanging out costumes. <laughs> oh my yeah, god! Yeah, there's so much of that. Um, you oh, know, I, it, it, you really can't. Pick Halloween's my something. favorite. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. I just so love people. dressing up, and so that all the costumes are fucking cool to me. Dude, shout out to oh, the five zero first. How about them? Yes. Like legit, like, like Star Wars. You, that's a whole nother level. Of, I mean, we'll Jesus. get on that. We'll talk about them a little later. There, it's talk it's, about the other costumes. But that's what I mean. Some of the R two D two and droids and shit that were there was fucking mind blowing. I think seeing though, like the Predator, that Predator. There was a couple. Um, were they Atjas? Uh, yeah. What? Are, yeah. Exactly. I think so. It's not that's an. What that's called, the right? movie's called Predator. Yeah. But. Uh, the one where it had the mask off, it looks so fucking real. Like, yeah. I'm not gonna lie, like I got chills when I was like, "Holy fuck!" Like looking inside his eyes, <laughs> dude. Like because it's so inset from the mask. I was tweaked out by it. Now, but, like, those were cool. I mean, Predator costumes are always fucking cool. The right. Little Shop of Horrors one was pretty that cool. one yes. was pretty cool. That's what I'm saying. The, the dude's got just ones. The dude's got a Bluetooth speaker on his side and and he's singing the fucking song. <laughs> yeah, like, moving the mouth and. I, that dude was either that dude might have been on some mushrooms or something because he was way too happy. Oh, he, had the, he had the fucking vision. Yeah. <laughs> Big Trouble, Little China. That's that what I'm saying. That was a real cool. good. Wasn't like the greatest looking. Kurt but Russell. Was, yes. Um, the I mean, bang. his wig wasn't movie quality, but no, but that's it fine. still was good. I, you know what I love too? Uh, the graboid. The dude had a cardboard box. Yeah, he no. made. He, Which yeah. one was it? The Graboid. Like right Trevor's. when we first got there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It Frankie, was the shittiest looking thing. Frankie Blue was so cool. load so quick. He was just like, I watch that movie every night. Every night before I, I watch that movie. <laughs> it's, it's, and uh, the guy looked at you and he was just like, great. Thanks, bro. <laughs> hey, man. I, 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 love give him, I give him respect. Oh, my God, my daughter. Respect that he absolutely gave it no fucks that like I'm gonna just put a cardboard box on I'm gonna make this thing with Dude, two strings it looks shitty not? and awesome at the same time and that's what I'm well, saying the, the you, grab boys right? look shitty and awesome at the no. same time in the movie <laughs> imagine if you saw a real one like remember that dude what? that played it's like uh, an uncircumcised penis with teeth yeah <laughs> <laughs> well like uh, Deadshot and uh, the, the fucking the lizard dude from, oh, uh, Croc. Su- Croc? Killer yeah, Croc. That, the Croc How about those? Legit. Right, he couldn't even yeah. move. He that was movie looked. quality. Well, that was yes. fucking hilarious with him. He's like, hey, can you guys take a picture for me? Like, I, can't move my, I can't move just... my fingers <laughs> because the fingers were rubber, and it was just like he had boxing gloves on with fingers on them. Yeah, so yeah. he's just... Uh, yeah, awesome costumes. But, the dude on the stilts. Yeah, when he was the droid. The f- yeah, from what was it? Uh, the Rogue one. one, yeah, no, Rogue One, oh, Rogue, Rogue One, one. Yeah. yeah, the big. I can't remember what. Dude, some that's what I'm saying. Some of those costumes that they went, I didn't were feel ridiculous. nerdy enough. At, I didn't feel nerdy enough at times. Uh, like, I, I'm, I, I'm I, like a, more of a movie nerd. Like I like, you know, like, I, I I just couldn't. Some of these costumes were like, oh, that's that guy. I'm like, who the fuck is that? Well, well, there was oh, also yeah, there was like all the anime stuff. I'm like, I'm not in anime at all. I love. <laughs> I'm in all the movie, all the old cartoons. I swear I'm to down. God, what is that, Sailor Moon? Yeah, Sailor Moon. Yeah, I mean, I I know I Akira and Ninja Scroll. Those are the two fucking and Ghost in the Shell. Those are the three animes I've ever watched, and those are from like 1994. See, I watched the movie Ghost in the Shell. 
Yeah, no. The, See, the anime Ghost in the Shell is the costumes dope. that we did recognize though, like like the the shit that was nostalgia, the Little Shop of Horrors, the the Bane the, from uh, that dude the that was Bane. Jack was ridiculous. <laughs> well, even the Drax dude, and then the seven foot tall Thor, yeah, man, yes. hitting the little kid in the face with the hammer. <laughs> oh God, he smoked him. The it, Sentinel, I, the, the Sentinel one the Sentinel might be my dope. favorite. The favorite, yes. Yeah. Because he had all, all little the, figurines of the X Men all Colossal over him attacking him, ripping oh. his back open yes. and stuff. Like I, I'm not gonna lie, I broke down and got Disney Plus it, all morning. X Men, yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Just, yes. Uh, the original X Men cartoon. They're so fucking dope. So pumped. Yeah, no, that one probably was one of the coolest ones. I, I agree. It looked so good. The face, the, yeah, the head, like. Yeah. Oh. Well, that was Magneto. Oh, was that the, the Magneto head. one that yeah. had the Sentinel head? Yeah. Well, there was also... I found out how absolutely midget-sized the Blue Ranger and the Black Ranger are in real life. Oh, God. <laughs> they yeah, so we met the original uh, people from the original show, and yeah, they were short, short as hell. Like four foot eleven. Yes, yeah. both of them. Like, like, seriously. Literally this tall. The Blue Ranger and the Black Ranger were like your height. Like five, and they five, probably three, weighed five, four. probably like 104 and, pounds. Yeah, for the, real. The like, Blue Ranger, especially that dude, yeah. looked like he was a skeleton with just skin pulled over. Yeah, him. It was crazy. Why? Well, I I, mean, even what? Twenty. You guys noticed years. that those two were together, but the red one we saw later. No, that was yeah. a different red one. Oh, okay, okay. He looked tiny as fuck too. Saw the dude play the the Night King the Night in Game King. of Thrones. Yep, we literally walked past <laughs> him. <laughs> Fucking face. That's what I'm saying. He We're was right. Go he was right one. by the 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 Rangers. Yeah. Who else was over there? Um, they had some other it, character actors. Yeah. that were over there. It, what was funny about that though was the black You'd the black Ranger and the Blue Ranger are both signing autographs at like this corner table. Jason David Frank, the Green Ranger. It was fifty dollars a picture and fifty dollars an autograph for him. And these guys are just fucking yeah, ten bucks. Yeah, here you go. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. I'd Ghostbuster bed sheets. Getting real behind the curtains here. But no, and, and we didn't, like, there wasn't a ton of celebrities that we really wanted to see because we're out of that loop. Well, I didn't want to, we were only there for one day. I didn't yeah. want to waste my day waiting, waiting in, in line. line. Yeah, it, yes. we're definitely like We could have met Carl sure. Urban from, like, Dread and, yeah. uh, what is the new show? The, the Boys. Boys. They had the whole panel, too, of the whole cast of The Boys. Like, Pam, Pan or Pan? Pan? Panel. Pamel. 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 <laughs> Like, but that would have been cool, thing. but I didn't want to waste, you know, an hour of that's three hours yeah. plus. You that's know. what I'm saying. In the CM Punk, literally, the line was so short. You like started going live. We went to the bathroom, came back. I was already up. It was, well, it was, it was like, great perfect. because he was just chilling all day. Like yeah. right. The other people have a certain time. They're only there between this and you know, this. Yeah. Nine gonna, and ten. I'm gonna tell you what weirded me out a little bit though about it was the alt comics where it was like the dude. Did you see the dude with the white beard, like the older guy drawing the gay comic book characters? <laughs> there was like four booths down from that. It was like these big jack dudes make it out. I'm like, yeah, I'm not just going to keep fucking walking because this is What's really fucking weird to me yeah, out. No, I, I must have missed that one. Frank is like, keep the vision. Keep the vision, bro. <laughs> I see you. I like, like your style. Like it was. It, the art, though, was amazing. Like it was that almost a mix between American and Japanese art. So it was like real realistic yeah and I'm walking past and BJ and I both looked at each other I'm like not stopping at that booth bro <laughs> don't stop at that it, booth the guy. Frankie was freaked out because BJ was going to different uh, like I guess what you call them booths or kiosks you know, yeah picking up whatever. toys and shit and then Frankie's like kind of wandering a little bit and he's like looking around where the fuck is BJ and then he'd be every right every fucking time him. Well, every like, fucking <laughs> Frank, time. Be like, where the fuck did you like come this, from? <laughs> where, how much is, I've been looking for him. I don't know what the fuck. Where did he, like seriously? Well, right there. what was hilarious too was <laughs> he blended. Yeah, like fucking. So it was perfect. black t-shirt, black hat, average height, black average average white, white male, white, white male. Yeah. beard. <laughs> yeah, beard. Jeff, we could find Jeff because he was wearing the Wolverine outfit. Right. <laughs> flannel, we could find flannel, me because I'm a fucking flannel. giant. Yeah. And then white f- and, horror jacket. Yeah. yeah, and then you had the. I had the horror movie jacket on. We just looked for you. Right. Like you guys like got ahead, and then you're like turning around. Dude, but waiting, BJ and I was, was like, standing around, next yeah. to me, and I'd be like, "Where the fuck did BJ go, guy?" And if, <laughs> in all honesty, I'm gonna tell you right now. Next year, I, I'm gonna do it. The 3D fucking printing. Yes, yeah, that's, that's pretty cool. We're, I I kept the card because I they are. Because they are. Explain it, Sean. They are. 
they're a uh, promote. They're a company that does a a sends you a camera around you and takes a three D image of your body and they three D print it. See how cool that shit is. It's a three D custom color printing. Is I don't even know if that's the name of the company. It's in Chicago. Yeah, uh, custom color three D dot com. They uh, and Dave Watcher is the guy that Frankie. Check out his vision. Dave Watcher. <laughs> Dave draws comics dot com. But so, the, <laughs> so the the 3D model, <coughs> so the 3D model thing was, it was either a three inch, a seven inch, or a seven inch, I believe, is what it was. I'm gonna take a look at this again. Three, five, or seven inch. And what they do so is you turn yourself into like a a, a statue, basically. Yeah. Three people. Yeah. So or what? Say four. No, you could do three. three. They, they did three. I was like, I would rather just us each spend the money on our own, 175 bucks, get the seven inch figures for ourselves. But I'm it, down. It, bro. it would be cool though to get one like. All together, you know what I'm saying? Just like, looking tough. Where we I, I just think we all just do our own. We can all get our own and then put them together. Well, yeah, yeah, I'll buy the three together. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh, you want the three together? Yeah. So I mean, if, we I could. want my own too, obviously. Yeah. In all honesty, if we do What's the your pose? if we do the three together, I just want to go the back standard. to I just want to go back to back to back. So when it, the camera goes around us, right? Like and so right. it would sit in the middle and just be like a fucking spinner. Spinner. But yeah, <laughs> that. We caught that like at the. We missed that all day. That could have been what I'm insane. I feel like well, we, missed, we like, missed a lot, a lot of shit. Of stuff, dude. We were, you know, we were Russian too. We, Russian? I mean, like, I'm American, bro. Yeah, I was. <laughs> How dare you? We were Russian when we left. You know, when we got there, and then we, you know, hit the bathroom. So then we were Well, European. what happened is, if we we like, all right, we haven't hit the middle, so we f- fucked the outside up. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we were, we were. Weary travelers to the middle. Yeah. We knew the outside very well. We'd get into the middle, and then we'd... Uh, we'd uh, like, uh, we were back like, out to the we, edge. We'd go left, and then we'd like get to a spot that we knew, and we were like, oh, the beer's over here. <laughs> <laughs> we'd get on the beer trail. So we'd get a beer, and then we would... Oh, God, motorcycles Woo. are out. It's getting yeah. warm in Wisconsin. Yeah. So, in all honesty, nice what day. I'm going to do next year, I think, is, fuck is, the middle? is bring the beer belt, and we'll just load the beer belt up. We need to leave like hey. breadcrumbs on the ground. So Next we time, know where we've been. I'm bringing a plastic <laughs> flask. That's all I know. Bring one of those backpacks. Huh? Yes, we were already yeah. talking. Me and Jeff, maybe this summer or fall, to go to another one in like Indiana or no, Ohio or something. We want to go to the big. You gotta go to C2E2. All right, so let's right. go to California. The yeah. big one, San Diego. <laughs> you wanna go to San Diego oh, Comic Con? Yeah, He's in, my lady's in. All right, or New York would be cool. I think we could take a train to New York. Um, That'd how be about cool to do too? How about no. we stay the fuck, fuck away from go. the coronavirus right now and no, that's yeah. infecting New York? So that's done. You know what? The coronavirus is only for old people. Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh! <laughs> that's a fucking good one, Gray Bushes. I seen a great thing about uh, <laughs> Chelsea Clinton. Chelsea it. Clinton on yeah. on Twitter. Who? Who Chelsea the fuck Clinton. You think you are? Chelsea, Chelsea Clinton? Clinton. You remember her? <laughs> <laughs> All right. See, rush hour. You got it, you right? Got it. All right so sorry. Chelsea Clinton posted about how <laughs> President Trump isn't doing enough about the coronavirus and people are dying and blah, blah, blah. So some savage commented, more people have died about to testify against your mom <laughs> <laughs> than have died from the coronavirus. So shut the fuck it's up. It's a 0.2% <laughs> if you're 50, it's 0.7 if you're 60, and 0.9 if you're 70 or older to be fatal. I guarantee more people have died choking themselves and masturbating this year than, than the from the coronavirus. <laughs> but listen, I'm not worried about it, obviously. If if well, I have to get quarantined for two weeks at my house, ooh, big fucking whip just means I get housework done. I'll be, I'll be on the VR. <laughs> You're always cleaning, bro. I'm always cleaning, baby. What do you clean? <laughs> what are you cleaning? Your socks? It's, I, I told clean. you not to disturb me when I clean in my room. <laughs> I, I clean my fucking house once a week. All right? Sean's got that vacuum going. <laughs> and with, I don't need to buy. I don't need to buy a paper shredder anymore because my dog decided to shred mail. So see, there you go. That's a felony, bro. <laughs> well, yeah, he, he got choked. He got choke slammed today. They choke can, slam. They he got be choke slammed today. They could. Be, right? Would you? <laughs> <laughs> don't you? Well, well, I. You know, I'm like, don't you ever do that again? You know, I show him the paper. I'm like, no, don't do that. Don't do that. I turn around and I grab my. You gotta bite that dog's ear. 
He, I turned back around. He's got the plastic piece hanging out of his mouth. From the, I'm like, like, you motherfucker in the cage. That's it. I'm leaving. <laughs> you can hang out in here for a couple hours. I'm going to go podcast. I'm telling you, bite that dog's ear. I already have. You know what he did? Bit me right back. See? That's not what happened. That's what's supposed to happen. That ain't what's supposed to happen. He's like, listen here, fucker. <laughs> this goes both ways. Kayla, can we get some uh, shots board? What? <laughs> oh, wow. Thanks, honey. You're Look at that. Best. I love you so much. So, yeah, we're definitely going to do another show. Kind Not of only a nurse. Whatever, but you want one of those, Kayla? No, you sure? Fuck. Yeah. Fucking one, A, honey. man. Come on, baby. Whoa. Come on, baby, baby, baby. What are you trying to do to us? You, you match those fuckers with I mean, me. I want no I, I did say pour them. <laughs> Fuck, I fucked You should have asked for butter on the toast. <laughs> and while you're at it, you want to make oh, one of these God. appear, too. Oh, shit. <laughs> No! A perfect... No, oh, God. Wow. Amazing. Uh, I can't wait to vomit on camera. It's gonna be great. I don't know if I can do all that. Guys, I don't even... It might be a sipping whiskey. I don't even like whiskey. <laughs> Babe, I don't like whiskey. Honey. Don't be a fucking pussy. So let's get into the 501 first real quick so we can start talking about the after party. Oh, God. Well, hold on. Kayla, can you take this and hold it up to the camera? The 501 first. Behind the bucket. In front of Kobe. In front of Kobe. Star yeah. 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 Seriously? Just yeah, just so people can so see. So they it. see. Just Look keep the vision. Dun 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 it's like a cardigan, but like slash, it looks like a beautiful Darth Vader cape. <laughs> <laughs> and every time she wears it, she comes around the corner, and it's just flowing beautifully. And I do the Imperial March every time. Well, well she's going to just dun, dun. Yeah, she wishes she could do the fucking <laughs> throat choke. Shut the fuck up. How funny was it, too, that every time BJ turned around, there was a Vader behind him. Like, he scared the shit out of him. Whoa, what the fuck, fuck is that? He's like, I hear someone breathing behind him. He's like, oh, is there some fat guy with asthma behind me? Nope, it's Vader. <laughs> Vader again. Yeah, I don't understand how he found BJ. I couldn't fucking find him. He's standing next to me. All right. Um, who wanted to do these shots? I do. do. Let's do, do these shots, and then we're going to talk about uh, the five hundred first and this badass the, documentary coming out behind the, the bucket. bucket. You want to grab me another uh, TBR? Oh fuck! What kind of shot were you hey, what the Babe, hell happened? I was gonna like a shot. This is a shot, shot. It's a shot. There's two shots in here at least. No, that's a fucking shot. What the? Someone switched the fucking. Someone switched these out on me. I don't know what happened. Thank you, my lady. Hey, to hope. Jeff's lady. Here, here. Uh, there we go. All right, let's try and do these. It's your poor shot, thanks. Fuck. All right, empty stomach gut bombers. Here we go. Let's oh, get. Let's hammer. Oh yeah, look at those faces. Let's get it. Holy fuck! Why did that go down better than the first one? I don't know. Because I'm bored with love. <laughs> like, I don't like whiskey. Stay hydrated. All right, oh. so the Bible first. We got to hang out with the uh, the guy who's directing the documentary or shooting the documentary. So a couple of guys. Can I help? Help you? Little guy. What's this for? Just a little. Just little a little rant. hair of the pup. A little hair of the pup that'll help you out. Bible first. Some fucking awesome guys. So Mike and Christine, mm -hmm. right? We're the ones shooting. Mike and Christine, and then uh, who's the other guy? Tom, right? We met at the bar. Yes. At the uh, the Geek Bash after, so I didn't even know about the 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 five oh, was it five oh first right five oh first. I know I remember talking to him and I started having a few drinks. I was like, so what's up with the five oh one? The fuck you just got? You about to pull his lightsaber out right there? Bro, he, you he almost he tried to give me the Vader <laughs> death choke. Motherfucker. Yeah. He was being polite, but you I gotta get do it for I the get, culture. I get tell. Vision. I get tell when I when I said five hundred one for like the sixth time. He's like, "All right, this fucker ain't gonna." <laughs> <laughs> so, so five hundred first. They're basically a cosplay unit that does all the uh, stormtrooper. Well, so mostly stormtrooper stuff. Yeah. Which is cool because they've done 
they've done extra work in the last Star Wars movie and stuff like that too. This so whole group. You, this group, you have to if you want to sign up for this. What is it like a chapter? Yeah, or, yes. uh, I don't yeah. Know it's, a, it's, a, it's it's legitimately a biker gang <laughs> mentality. Well, you like, can look up Five O First. I mean, they're like probably the most famous group in the. I'm States. pretty sure that. They didn't take 501st from Star Wars. Star Wars took it from them. I'm pretty sure. See, that's fucking Like when they crazy. started making like yep. the new movies, they took the 501st. So like you are saying, to become BJ, part of this. BJ. I know. I Mike wish you Tom, could have been here Christine, today. But. Don't beat my ass if I screw this up. <laughs> yeah. I'm pretty sure that's how it went. But you have to make a costume. It has to be movie accurate. Quality. And, and they, you have to submit it. Yeah, they have to see it. They have to approve it. To and approve and it yes, they to have to vote and prove. Approve your costume to wear. Yeah. I'm sorry, your attire, right? Outfit? Yes. They, they don't call it costumes, bro. All right. I'm just making sure. Your armor. Yes. Costumes like something. Your vision. Like so. <laughs> How did they do cool, like, Naturally. Like, like, oh, God. Right, yeah, that's yeah. like their slogan is bad guys doing good, right? Yes. Yeah. They go. They do all the make-a-wish stuff. and the, Yes, and, and that is so fucking cool. They, and it's all voluntary. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So they, they'll get like, hey, we're having this event at the hospital. So people will dress up like stormtroopers, Darth Vader, and they'll just go and like cheer up kids that are in like the cancer unit. or. I feel like we should uh, have a goal and do that and start saving a little bit of money, maybe, you know, five ten dollars $10 a week hey, bro, I, in I, another year. I'm not going to lie to you. I don't want to be the fat stormtrooper. I'm sorry. No, that's fine. We'll just put <laughs> a big fucking rag on top of you and you'll do that beard. You'll just look like one of those... I, Old retired Jedi that just don't have it anymore. I do. I do. I, I do. I do want a grape flavored lightsaber. <laughs> Fucking pizza the hut. <laughs> <Flavored lightsaber. laughs> oh shit! Fucking pizza but the there hut. Was some cool stuff. Mace Windu, the only but black my, guy in the galaxy. Next year, <laughs> we'll talk. We'll get on this more. We'll get. We'll actually hit this accurately yes Mike once and, we had Mike and tom on. said that they'd come by I, so. I wish you guys were you know we we decided to do this but i wish we were just a little bit more fun and ready for it I when i talked to, to mike buy. about about behind the bucket a little bit uh-huh. i was i was barely getting there and then we went to the after party and i was talking to tom about it full on you were, barely remember what the hell we were talking about <laughs> so tom is <laughs> Is a special effects guy, so he makes all the uh, props, for props movies. for movies for blame, for blame. For, yeah, shout out to blame. Who can you blame? Um, Dot com. Okay. There you go. <laughs> but he made this Harley Quinn mallet for this girl that dresses Harley Quinn, it's fucking and dope. it looks fucking, Legit it shit. looks fucking real, like real wood. But dude, it's a PVC tube that he's like, I just scored it up, painted it brown, and threw some black shoe polish in it, so it looked like wood. And then everything else is plastic. So in fucking it. realistic, though. It was insane. It's so fucking cool. I want to do where we all buy the random lightsaber. Lightsaber? To set. So you could you could pick out you could pick out. I'll buy you some lifesavers. No, like at the lightsaber at the lightsaber you booth, you could buy pick one that you want for two hundred. Yeah. Or no, you could buy one. a. A box, a random, random box. box. It had, you didn't know what you were getting. I'm cool with a random box. Yes, I wanted to do right. all three of us, and then whatever we get, we build. Bro, I got a money. Costume. I know you could save. You see what I just bought? I don't have any money. Yeah, there's. Look. Why don't oh, you bring it over here? Can huh? you bring, yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll look at my my Walmart purchase. I, lo- I love the video that I got by this by, of this by the way. Babe, I, I couldn't resist it. it. What I is saw every, it at Walmart, and it just spoke to me. What does every 36 year old child need? A fucking four wheeler monster truck ecto cooler. Ecto, ecto, ecto one. one. <laughs> ecto cooler, yeah. Dude, Walmart. Sixty bucks, bro. How fucking cool for is an that? Ecto one four monster by truck. Four. Instead of buying food for the week, keep buying. Dude, I don't buy myself shit. I buy I these kids stuff all the time. I saw this in the toy store at Walmart, toy section, and I was like, I want it. I went home, I didn't get it for myself. Willpower, and I kept thinking about it and thinking about it. So I went online, could barely find these fuckers. I found the cheapest one was like ninety bucks. There was one for like a hundred and seventy dollars. See, let's just put that one up. We'll all sign it. Five grand. Gentleman's Den. The It'll be worth dead. twenty dollars. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> it actually loses value. It actually loses value on the way down. I love this thing though, there. man. How fucking cool is this? It is. Cool. It is fucking awesome. The fucking Ghostbusters car. XL1. I want to play. The Ghostbusters game on VR is still tonight. Oh, bro. It's happening. Right now, the boys are playing the VR. 
Bella's too. They're enjoying the fucking shit out of it. <laughs> are they on li- Are they on, They're on the line? Right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, way to go, kid! So I brought, I brought the parent. PS4 over, and the kids are occupied playing the uh, VR for the first time. Fucking minds are blown. We're gonna play the Ghostbusters and some shit later. I play Ghostbusters every time I piss on a turd in the toilet. Play Turd Busters. <laughs> Don't cross the streams. Baby. Don't ever cross the streams. Yeah, who are you who are you pissing with? Bro, I got this guy. <laughs> Dude, you're 40. He's you the, still pee next to people? He's, he's, he's from the 13th floor. Let's bring him over. Hey, hey guy, come over. We that's another thing, too. The you the floor, the movie with the guy. You know, that's not a real thing in hotels and everywhere. I don't know if you guys know. I'm probably sure you do. But in, like, any building, there is no 13th floor. Do you know that, young yes. girl? Yeah. Young girl over there? Yeah, I've been to the city. Um, yes, there is. Is it? Go outside. No. Go outside. And count, and count, count the windows. Yes. Okay. But so you're I'm not saying, fooling anybody. There's no that 14th number in floor the is the 13th fucking floor. I get yeah, it. 14's technically 13. But right. there is no 13th floor. On not the elevator. everywhere. Not everywhere. I don't think so. Just places that are haunted. Dude, everywhere is haunted, man. I'm just saying. It's all. It's a real thing, isn't it? We all, we all live on Indian burial ground, bro. <laughs> <laughs> the kids will love it playing the VR. I know yeah, they are. They're, they're going for it. It's so fucking cool. It really I, is. I asked them because they're, they're X- I'm Xbox. They're me too. Xbox. Yeah, me too. And uh, I was like, hey, I'm thinking about getting the VR. And they're like, we played it. I was like, oh, yeah? You played it? So they were, they were like talking shit. I was like, I'm going to trade in this Xbox and get VR. They're like, no. Now they actually played it, bro. They never played it. They never played it. Now in, they in played it. In all honesty, it's. They probably played some trash. Where you had to use a controller and it wasn't very like, submersive. Yeah. This is like what game? That Farpoint game. Farpoint and Firewall. You know I love the and, Cosmos, bro. Yes. I'm up in space. This game, Farpoint, <laughs> is like Starship Troopers. Yes. Oh my God. Fucking spiders jumping in. Would you, you like to know more? Wait, did you did try? You did try it right <laughs> last time. Me? Yeah. Yeah, dude. For a minute. He tried it, bro. He tried it. I was shooting dudes. I was hip shooting I was guys. <laughs> Commando. <from the laughs> head, I shoot the <laughs> dude. Aiming down the side. That's for pussies. Look at look at how fucking small you look. Why? Because you're standing. Dude, in front back of up, me, you idiot. Let's sit next to him. <laughs> there you go. Now I'm big again. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Jabba. Stone zone. Jabba. Yeah, I. Uh, Speaking of big again, yeah, I'm. I cut out all the bullshit again. What do you mean? What's the bullshit? I was hammering down sodas like water. I was eating little debbies like fucking. So I. Your fucking, curse is snacking. So bad. You are a snacker. You're a snack fucking machine. Snacker. So it's it's bad. weird. Like I I had the taste for it for a month, and then I went to the grocery store and I walked down the aisle. I'm like, oh, get my normal, and I'm like, I don't want it. That's good. No. I mean, if I can stop smoking, I think you can lay off the snacks. Right. I don't know. This man, is my next thing. I'm stopping. <laughs> coke? <Sodas. So laughs> I'm quitting. I'm, I'm, done, I'm done with the Coke, guys. I'm actually down. I'm, call leaf. I'm down to a raspberry iced tea out of the can right now. And then that's it for the caffeine. Sounds horrible. <laughs> no, it's, it's br- the brisk. It, the brisk is it's fucking brisk, delicious. Baby. <laughs> it's brisk, baby. Who keeps ringing that bell? I can't concentrate. <laughs> the Nova. <laughs> Oh man! Yeah. Classic so universe. we get to the after party. Then we'll go back to the C two E two stuff. Because that's what this was all about. That's why we weren't here last weekend. Because we were all drunk fucks on Sunday. Still, I said, not happening. Can't do it. And it's at his house, and we can't do it. No, Jeff, Jeff I can't even make it down to the garage. Jeff just sent a text, <laughs> and he was just like, not happening. <laughs> I love you guys. Next week. Oh, God. <laughs> and I said, 100%. <laughs> I'm like, no fucking way am I trying to record it. It was rough, but it was such a good so, time. So, there was a dude, foreshadowing here, there's a dude dressed as Scott Steiner. Remember when we went to... Oh, him? his costume was legit. Yeah, because he was At definitely bar, on, yeah. on fucking was on all of them. He was on all the steroids. <laughs> But he looked exactly yeah, like yeah, him. The goatee, hey, the shout out to St- Scott Steiner. He actually just passed out or just had a heart attack at a show. Whoa. He's Fuck. just had a, he's what, going into heart surgery. He was going into heart surgery before I got here. And he's doing um, well. Hopefully. So, All right, cool. Good for Scott Steiner. Fuck. Big Papa Pump. The Big right? Bad Booty Papa Daddy. Pump. I'm just saying, pay it forward. 
So I do my things. We're there. We're hitting on well. It's my Frank, pieces of Frankie's, metal. Don't look Frankie's, at me like that. Frankie got shot down by an average-looking bartender because she was gonna go fuck Stephen Amell. Oh, <laughs> <from> Arrow! <laughs> shot down from Arrow. You got shot down. You I'm got pretty shot sure down. I was making conversation. Yeah, and then no, she's, because the guy from Arrow was there the night before, and yeah. she left to go bang him. <laughs> so you got <laughs> shot down by Arrow. But I was. I, she's I, like, do you guys true. watch Arrow? I'm like. No, she's like the guy. I'm like, yeah, I know who I know the guy. Yeah, what yeah. guy she's talking about? He was in here last night. I'm gonna go fuck him. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna well, lie. Good luck. I'm not gonna lie. When she Have was like saying that, him? I thought she was like, because I'm not bullshit. And I was on uh, Netflix and shit, and new episodes of The Arrow are out recently. Just, really? It just came out. So is that I thought code? she was going home to watch Arrow. I said, no, she said she was going this. to bang him. Yes. So that's what I'm saying. Side note I'm, here. <laughs> I'm, I go to bang him. At <laughs> this situation too, she came up to me. And I'm like, "Oh, Stephen Amell, yeah, he's probably next door at the wrestling show." She goes, "How did you know that?" I go, "Well, because he wrestled for that company before it became Just a company." Just be honest, she blew you in the back. That's why you were gone now, for so long. You were gone for a fucking I half hour. Gone. I was That's asking questions. Place. I don't remember her answers. But she. I was like, "Have you?" I was worried about her. I was like, "Have you actually established contact?" Are you just going to show up? <laughs> yeah, maybe you're just not going to answer the door. Do you even know what room is it? That is exactly what he sounded like. <laughs> I'm so concerned. So because we started gambling on talking to this chick. And I would, I would, she's like, I'm from Florida. I love the cold weather. And then we were like, what? So we were asking why she why, moved up Why here. did you move up here? And the first, we all took bets. Loser had to buy the round of shots. And uh, It was fan. Uh, well, no, it was before that was, it was d- does she own a studded belt? Yes. <laughs> Because she in, in yeah, we were in Chicago at yeah. the bar. That and was she the had first like the one. black, you know my thing, the blonde hair with the black underneath. She had it going on. <laughs> so trashy. I love it. She and hey, she had a Harry Potter tattoo. Harry Potter tattoo. I was in. So Frankie goes, she doesn't own a studded belt. Me and Jeff are like, this bitch I mean, owns a studded she belt. She hundred percent looked like she owned a studded hair? belt. Yeah, but yeah, so oh, yeah. she goes she, didn't. she goes, I only wear dresses. I only wear dresses. I'm and from the, Florida. And I go. Well, guess yes. guess we have to buy Frankie a shot. Who gives a fuck? Let's get these shots done. Because it was twelve dollars for a fucking four ounce glass. First of all, when we got there, the bouncer checked their IDs, right? Oh, I need to show it again. Yeah, it said we were from Wisconsin. Yeah, all right. So he should have told the bartender right away. Cut the four these guys are glasses. professionals. High class. They're not oh, fucking boys. around. Because she handed me my glass, and I was like, "Where's the rest of Legitimately. <laughs> Add an inch on these right. shot glasses. So I spent six bucks. Six bucks a drink. I spent a lot of money at Comic Con. Kayla, I plug almost your ears spent. Quick. We're gonna about to talk about how much I spent <laughs> on alcohol. On alcohol. Oh, yeah. I spent <laughs> almost as much Jeff as alcohol. And I, Jeff and I both did the whole same day. amount out, and we both pretty much spent the same amount of money. Oh, I don't All know right. So when she time. was giving me shots, Daddy drinks, was getting it done. I was getting bar. a discount. When dude, fucking Who homeboy. Was? I was. I want to talk about Homeboy. Let's let's just talk about before Which that. one? There was a couple of them. No, um, the bald fuck. That came in for the... Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. That basically was, called the, us the, racists. Let me get to that guy in a minute. <laughs> oh, boy. Because that pissed me off to the fucking... I was like, we need to get the fuck out of here before I kill this guy. Well, there was only a party. There was like certain... Like, so, drink specials it for was, only two hours. It was hours from like for, 7 to 10. 7 to 10, yeah. yeah. So, so they were... They, were they weren't really specials. The shit was still like 6 bucks. Where I'm was, from, from... Where I'm from... Yeah, yeah but... You get two beers and, a, but it was and like, a token. You could get the Harley free Quinn one. drink. So it, it was, was like, like red, white, and blue shit, and uh, or you could get the Incredible Hulk. It was green. Who gave a no, fuck? No, it was it the was, Hulk. Not yeah, the incredible get Hulk. fuck. That's what it, it was. Wasn't it wasn't hypnotic in Hennessy. How dare you? I was All drinking right. Corona. I was gonna <laughs> put that out there. I'm like, I ain't drinking any of this diabetes juice that you're All trying to serve. All discretion I had. You got about all the Corona there. Six fucking Harley Quinns. Well, yeah, you had six Harley Quinns and four Hulks. My favorite part was. <laughs> my favorite part was. Frankie, oh, I drank just as much as Jeff did. I go, no, you fucking didn't. Hold on. No, what? you didn't. Hold on. You know, you know what I fucking got? I got another person that didn't know what a Jameson Neat was. I, this guy's like, oh, he what do you want? Bartender. Yeah, fucking. He, he was pouring Jameson and Coke with no anymore. ice. So no, yeah, you were you were standing next this to me when I ordered. This was a huge debacle. Go ahead and explain. If you remember, you can. Explain I go. It. Can I get a uh, Jameson Neat? And can I and get a, a coke, coke with no ice? And a coke or and coke? No, he said and, a coke. And a coke with no ice. He goes, gotcha. 
takes a glass, pours a shit ton of Jameson in it, and starts with the coke. <laughs> I'm like, oh, no. I need her to drink anyways. I go, do you know what you're doing? I go, can I get a Jameson knee? And he's like looking at me. He starts putting ice in the cup. No! <laughs> neat. Jameson. Neat. That and then he never got nothing. a Coke. Yeah, so <laughs> yeah, he so gave him yeah. a shit ton of fucking Jameson. You it know. cost him 36 bucks for that Yes, drink. it did. It, the it other girl was it charging. It was like $28 for my shot. Yeah. For my one drink. So. It pours me like a half a fucking little six ounce cup. And then I'm drinking this thing out of a plastic cup. You know, it should be served in glass. Whatever. So I drink it. And I'm like. <clears throat> oh, <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> I got headphones on and I fucking heard that, dude. I'm across the room from you. No, I'm sorry. So, oh, how's your butthole? My butthole. My butthole. My butthole. My butthole. I really hope that's fucking recording. What do you mean? Well, I mean, audio is recording fine. I'm just, I don't know. If the video? video? Yeah. I see it up in the corner. Right. Look at it. Oh, they 16. moved it. 16. Yeah, it, it, they upgraded. Got you, bro. Okay. We're 55. All right. They upgraded. I'm sorry. They upgraded the let me upgrade you, Sean. So, all right. So, bottom so Frankie, line is, Frankie, Frankie takes. I spent as much on alcohol as I did on all the art and all. So, the Frankie, I leaves, didn't buy any art. Frankie, it Frankie dips to go get his vitamins. <laughs> so he had to walk back to the. While he was gone, Jeff decided to say, ah, "We're at a we're at a fucking uh, marathon right now." No, nah, no, nah, we're in sprint mode. He turns it up. And, and he had at least four drinks while Frankie was gone. But no, 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 no. No, he didn't. I no, he fr- didn't. How dare you? Frankie was gone for a half hour plus because he got lost. I, got lost. <laughs> I literally was, it was like two around. blocks away. Was like, <laughs> it was literally two blocks away. <laughs> I'm here. I got my phone this way, and I'm like, I got to hop in this motherfucker. <laughs> like Joey from Friends, you would know. I had to hop so, in my map, and I found it back. Jeff's turning it up, and I'm just drinking a Corona going, oh, boy. It's going to be a good night. It's going to be a good night. But it was fun. I was so finger fun. dancing. <laughs> yeah, he did do the fucking... <laughs> <laughs> I'm a snake. So BJ's mind was blown. He'd never seen anything like it. Yeah, BJ's life. got video of it that he needs to... He sent to Jeff. Needs to send to me so I can fucking I'll edit it. I'll send it to you. And it's put on it the on line. The, put it on, wow. on the line. I seen finger it. dancer. So, <laughs> so our bartender that was dealing with us gets off work to go fuck Arrow. And this, I hope she did. You this right. this live her best life. This fucking like douchebag right. bartender that comes in to replace the show, him. The guy from the show. That comes in to re- fucking place him. First off, he had a glorious beard. Shout out to this guy's beard. It was impeccable. He it was looked, fucking great. I'm not against Should've it, but he honestly... But okay. So... For sure. Frankie asks for something. Jameson Neat. No, 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 wasn't even that. no. Jeff was <laughs> Jeff was asking. For, Jeff was asking for a drink, and the guy goes, "Oh, I don't drink. I'm a vegan. I'm this. I'm that." Yeah, but if you start talking that. about opioids, I'm like, yeah. Right, okay. Like instantly, I'm like, okay, fuck this guy. So we all get one more round of drinks, and then he's like, um, "Yeah, the crowd's about to change. There's gonna be a lot of Haitians, a lot of Jamaicans, well, well, yeah, well, a, a lot right. of Canadians." And he did the fucking <laughs> quotes. Canadians are the worst. Meaning black people. Black, yeah. And I look at this fucking guy. I go. I've never heard them referred to as Canadians. Oh really? I have. Yeah. yeah, yeah off yeah, air, I'll tell you. Okay. Because I don't want us to look like a bunch of racist assholes. No, and we're not. We're it's not. just because of what other but people this, make. But this fucking. Of first off. I'm, I'm sending this out to this guy right now. First off, asshole, don't wear capri pants if you're a fucking man. Don't wear fucking shirts with zippers on the fucking side. Fucking tell him. And number Whoa. three, don't assume Whoa. that just because we're fucking white guys that we're racist. Move his mic. He was basically uh, telling us, hey, guys, get the fuck crowd's going to change. It's time to go. Right. But, I don't give a fuck. What do you like, mean? What the fuck, man? I, I'm, I'm here, here to party, fuck, bro. I'm here to fucking yeah. spend money on booze. As long I as they're here to party, too. In here. We ain't got a problem. Let's fucking party. His views onto everybody around him. He, he was a he fucking was a jerk off. Right. And it was called something. It was like the new Norwegian Carib- Caribbean. No, no it, was, it was Afrocentric music is what it was called. It was Afro something. So I understood what... I understood what we were, what was coming into the fucking place. I had no problem with it. Well, I, had a, the fucking I had a drink. grind CD in high school called Aphrodisia. 
but and what, a bunch all of I'm fuckers. saying is that after you got now sixteen. All I'm saying is as soon as he said Probably the fucking now three. As soon as he said the fucking <laughs> he said, oh. and did the air quote Canadian. I looked at this motherfucker and I was like, dude. Yeah. I'm like, fuck should, I t- you. should I have told him I'm Sicilian? You should have. You should have. You fucking cocksucker. <laughs> but it was just one of those things where it's like, don't assume my gender. You pe- Wait, what? <laughs> no, assume your gender for sure. Because hey. you kept asking us to touch it. You want to touch it? <laughs> you touch it? That's not your gender. Or your sexual mm-hmm. orientation. Mm-hmm. But, but yeah, he goes, oh, no. No weed, no meat. No, but yeah. if you have opioids, I'm like, dude. Like, yeah, bro, I'm I just, walk around with a handful of Percocets. I at just all asked. Times. I said, "What do you suggest?" And then, yeah, and it, that's it, what I, started. I, and the and whole then it fucking just opiates. <laughs> yeah, I got two fucking rules. Don't touch my Percocets. That's you gotta be Percocet. fucking Percocets. Percocets. So yeah, I just wanted. I asked them what he suggested, and it turned into his. I knew he was a vegan. I knew uh, where he lived. I knew he didn't like black people, and I knew uh, it was a whole time bunch to get the fuck yeah. out of there. <laughs> I knew he, what I knew. You know what I knew? He wore pre pants and shirts with zippers on the side. The fuck he had wait no wait. I'm pretty sure he had on a sleeveless hoodie sweater with zippers on the side that yes. were zipped up. Yeah. Great. No, no, they were unzipped. Un- See, it wasn't unzipped. They were yeah. zipped up. And it, it wasn't like, the fact that I. Well, it, I mean, it was. On, it was it time to go. Daddy spent a lot of money, <laughs> there, and I was uh, getting on tilt. But I didn't want to give that fucking dude any of my money. Right? No, no. I was so. I Another instantly I became me aggravated. For my drinks. So good. I wasn't there. We leave. Yeah. We leave. We go back to the car. BJ's like, "Oh, bro, there's an after party at the Hilton or Hyatt." One of those which places. is right, right next door. Which is six minutes away from the parking garage. Walk. Six minute walk. Six walk. minute walk. Frankie's like, we're driving it. <laughs> I'm like, dude, why don't we just park the car? We've moved down because there's a ton of people leaving. <laughs> we drove for 12 minutes. We drove for more than 12 minutes. We were in the car for a half hour. Maybe. I guess where we parked, honey. Right back in the same <laughs> place. <laughs> <laughs> it cost Frankie $50 to park that day. But he could have cost him 25 if we would have just walked out. I just had to pull over and piss again so bad. I wasn't even paying attention. Well, no. We had to park there because that was the only place to park. That was the only place to park. So we park. We all piss. We get into this after party. Jeff is on fucking 11. Hammered drunk. No. We go. We went and got food. We went to, we started... we went to go find food. And Jeff's like, fuck you guys. You don't even like me. And just fucking <laughs> took off. <laughs> Beeline. There's so many people wearing costumes. I'm you know, I, I spent just gonna, I $50. Went over, I went back over by uh, uh, BJ and Mike and, yeah, all the 501st uh, crew and just talking. What's up? I ordered What's up a burger, that? And I was looking at costumes. Dog. Like, wow, you, you ordered that? Mac, mac and cheese. That you never got. I never got. I spent $50 at this fucking place. It was horrible. Dude, when you're rich and single, you can't. I, I I had a chicken wrap. That was cold, but I was like, I don't care. I'm Dude, fucking starving. When I got <laughs> your McDonald's, when I got home and I yeah. ate your plain cheeseburger, all I I'm had gonna was be honest, grease in my mouth. They all said plain. They all said plain. And one of one those of them that, I, that had I had was not plain. Was not plain either. See? They fucked up. They, they fucked the one by Meyer. They fuck you when you go to Oh, yeah, we yes, did. We did. They fucked up the last time. Yes, they, they do. Yep, and Mike Manis spilled his night. fries all over the floor. And you know what I did? <laughs> hey, you guys I called. scooped them up. Threw them in the bag. Those are the fries I was eating. We were all eating them. Yeah, I sent you the picture. I was like, these guys are so And as me and Mike were eating them, we were looking at each other like, they don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> These are on the floor of your car. So we're... Mike's car was clean as shit. The ride home. Right. I thought they tasted like armor all. So <laughs> we... BJ goes his way. I physically push Jeff out of the building oh, for us to leave. Because he was... And uh, I'm helping you guys out. I'm going to help you guys out. You guys are going to get some pussy. I'm gonna get some pussy. And, and I'm like, Jeff, we're getting the fuck out of here because we need to leave. I think you were like, I got to get home to Stewie. He's like, I got fucking kids at home, bro. Yeah, this guy's we're like, here to party. Bro, we need to leave soon. My dog. I'm like, I got kids. <laughs> yeah, but you got Kayla there for the kids. She had to work. Yeah. But, so we get out. That's another reason why we weren't doing the podcast on Sunday. I was hungover as fuck yeah. watching my daughter. So I pushed, I literally pushed Jeff out to the car. We get in. He gets in the back seat. 
Midnight says time. three words and we just hear. It's <laughs> 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 probably on the lines. There's a penis on your sunroof. Penis. <laughs> We're driving back and legitimately yeah, still there. Legitimately, Frankie and I both look at each other and I go, dude, I really want to see someone slam into those gates that block you from going to the express lane. Two seconds later, there's a guy with one leaned against the front of his car, and he's changing his he front He was already tire. on his third one that he hit. <laughs> <laughs> That's how far you get. I'm like, I wonder how many you make it through before you stop. <laughs> three. It's three. Right. It's three. <laughs> I found so, out. It's like shooting and, a bullet in a couple of blocks of ice. Like, right. How many is going to penetrate? <laughs> Legitimately, five minutes later, there's three cars, no hazards on, parked in the center lane in of the, the fucking of the intersection. Fucking. No lights on, no Four nothing. Nice I was fucked up, but I know I saw it. He saw it too. I, I look at Frankie. I'm like, dude, get over in the next lane. I just said, move over one lane. Because if we didn't, we were going to fucking end up in the ass end of a fucking S10. And it was like around a fucking corner. Yeah. It was, I just yeah. had a, one of those gut feelings. I was only doing 88. I felt like I was in Back to the Future. You're about to see some serious shit. Some serious shit. So we we you got remember. to we got to one point where I knew see? I wasn't that fucked up. We were, we were back. <laughs> we, we were back to where Frankie leaves for work, basically from work. So I'm like, all right, I'm gonna close my eyes for a second. Then I hear Frankie start talking shit. These two motherfuckers sleeping, motherfuckers, <laughs> sons of bitches. I'm like, dude, I'm awake. I just have my eyes closed. But when I'm I look good. over, both of you. Got the look. No, Jeff's in the back seat sawing hard logs in the back seat. Soft serves. So we make it back on McDonald's. Get McDonald's. I was completely sober at that point. I sobered up for a long time. We got I got home, I ate my McDonald's, and that was it's my it. My list. What do you it's just the fucking thing. <laughs> Your grammar, you don't know how to spell my grammar. Hold on, you make fun of me because I don't know how I to have spell. Auto's correct. All right. <laughs> Yeah. So what are we closing? What's our closing note this week? Huh? Keep the vision. Keep the vision, bro. <laughs> well, Respect. you got one. You got one more thing to add because we are you over an hour. No, it's it? it just. I mean, no, because there, there's there's shit in here we can go over forever. You touch I it? just wanted a quick thing. I didn't know Black Bear was white. Just found that out. <laughs> he's, a, he's a white Canadian. I actually. just found this out. I've been listening awesome to Black music. Bear for a while now. Awesome and music. I just found out that he's white. He's a white Canadian. That's why if you listen to the one song. Oh, is he related to Snow? <laughs> no, he. <laughs> but in the one Informer. song. Informer. I lick you boom boom down. I didn't know what he in said. In the one song, <laughs> he talks about Drake taking all the good girls when he's in town. Ooh. Because he's from Toronto as well. Wow. That it's got to suck when you got to compete against Drake. The grassy. The grassy. The grassy these assies. <laughs> I feel like I want to show this. Catherine. That's it. Show. Oh, yeah. Shout oh. out. And uh, go check out the uh, go check out the trailer. Just go on YouTube. Uh, behind the bucket. Check it out. Shout out to Mike, Catherine, and Tom. Yeah, they were super nice fucking folks. Uh, I had. I can't wait to get I had him on a the fucking podcast. Blast. Yeah, it was. I I really can't wait to get him on the podcast. That's what's great about those events. We even talked about it because everyone there is just they're in the same community. You know, the same like Did you everyone's realize dressed that up. Day you were a big ass nerd more than you thought you were. Actually, I'm not nerdy. I'm a huge enough. nerd, bro. I, nerd, I nerded. Not so nerdy hard. enough. I'm not right. nerdy enough. But the camaraderie between all the nerds everyone, was yeah. fucking awesome. Yes. Yeah, there was no Best issues. Oh, Nothing. No. Like, you bumped into someone, they're like, oh, oh I'm so sorry, me. so yeah, sorry. No, like, me. everyone was just super polite, yeah. super cool, the one thing awesome. super friendly. I fucking loved it. Yeah. The one it thing was, I it was fucking say, awesome. Way too many spandex Spider-Man costumes. How dare you, Sean? Way too many. You almost wore my spandex. Tube socks. Way, yeah, way too many, dude. Spandex. <laughs> way too many. I was going to go as Klaus Yeah, in the Umbrella Academy. Fat, overweight, But slow, I decided to go as middle-aged Wolverine. <laughs> <laughs> Which middle-aged Wolverine YouTube is coming soon. Oh, it's coming. Oh, God. We're going to film that. For sure. Yeah. Push it yeah. again. Push it Push one it. more time. Push it. Chuck. Touch it. What the fuck, Batman? <laughs> we're having technical difficulties. Push Always it. with the fucking technical difficulties. You guys got any shout-outs since we're shouting it out? Uh, go check out whocanyoublame.com. Who can you blame? Who can you blame? Buy your brother. 
Legion the art M. I got, I will have to bring and show. Legion because. M. Shout out to Legion M. Hopefully they'll uh, be the ones releasing uh, BJ's stuff. Woo! Which would be awesome. Which will, will I, I mean, I guess we'll confirm. Yeah. Or deny this later. <laughs> yeah. Dude, we could say whatever we want, bro. We'll just say we fucked up. So. It's a little different. For Jeff. Huh? For Frankie. Huh? Yeah. We love you? It's one of these fucking ends of podcast. Let your fucking so. freak flag fly. Yeah, be get, a geek. Get just nerdy. Like me. Just be a nerd. Fuck nerdy, not the dirty. The coolest geek you guys know, I'm just saying. Fuck nerdy, not dirty. And yeah. also, go to shop.spreadshirt.com backslash the hyphen gentleman's hyphen den for all your gentleman's den needs. Just so we could keep the vision. So we could keep the vision. <laughs> so we could show respect. <laughs> and uh, so Jeff can make some cool new designs because he's... His, I'm his, back, bro. I got the vision. His vision is back. Vision. You got the bug of the vision. I'm drawing a six foot. He's got the look. gremlin. Who? He's got the power. The fuck? Yeah. Boogie Nights. The song Mark Wahlberg sings. That's Jeff. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, and by the way, next year our costume is going to be a uh, biodome. Yes. They can sell. Sean's going to be the professor. He's going to have crazy fucking hair with a pirate. No. I am, I am God. 